not uncommon to see evictions taking place in downtown Johannesburg and Hillbrow in this instance. Uh, it's an area where the property prices have recently risen, where the demand for low-cost housing is high. And that seems to be something that the government are echoing. For the first time, we're seeing government invest more in bursaries. Welcome to Connect, a platform where you, the online community, are in control, connecting views and opinions. The fact of the matter about freedom of expression is just because you're entering a Virgin Active, a private setting, doesn't mean that you're leaving your constitutional rights at the door. And that's really been the centre of the debate here. You're absolutely right. Since the production line of Henry Ford, there was uh, robots creating cars. The difference is that robots are now not just imitating our muscles, but they're also imitating our minds. The biggest fear of young people today is jobs. And they've got every reason to be fearful of not having a job. Because in my lifetime, going forward, every single job that can be automated, that can be done by a robot, will be done by a robot. So what are we going to do? It would appear that the Virgin Active uh, stance that they've taken may be their latest form of activism. Have we seen gender violence being addressed at this trial? When it comes to social media, there has been a lot of people speaking about the fact that uh, gender is a real issue. We know that the Mabonang precinct do not own these buildings. We know that the city of Johannesburg know who does own these buildings. And we know that they're not willing to share that information at this stage. A woman died that night. Do you believe this song is appropriate? Do you think it's respectful to her or her family? Um, it's exactly right that it is a fine line. Stuart, do you think satire has its place in a murder trial like this? Obviously, there's a lot and of uh, government spokespeople that will be here. Why is it important for the community be to be here? Why are you here today? The video was viewed more than 20 million times in just 24 hours. Siki, I'm in big trouble. I heard Tuesday is statistically the cheapest day to fly, but I'm looking to fly on Friday. I bought some bases, some chicken, mushroom, tomatoes, of course, the puree. And Africans such as myself will sacrifice their hair for a good cause. Make of that what you will. That's all for now. We'll join you next time for hashtag ENCA Live. Make sure you're watching the documentary tomorrow. Remember to catch us on Facebook and tweet us. Yusuf Omar, who's been working that story. Our own Yusuf Omar. Yusuf Omar. That's our reporter, Yusuf Omar.